mention this earlier, you know, I'll, like I said, I'll keep the gushing out of it, like, oh my god, Chopper's easy. But Chopper's <laughs> is almost a penguin light in the sense that he is so good at catching on to what you want to do yes. mid-game and shutting that down. Unless you come up with an insane answer that he's just not able to react to quick enough. If Thronork, if he's able to keep it relatively even throughout, you know, however many games this set goes, then I think it'll be okay because if, if you can keep even with Chompers, that's a really big accomplishment. It's a, it's a, it's a big feat for sure. Um, I, I am speaking from very personal experience. Yes. You guys um, have played over, what, a hundred times We now? literally... Like, actually a hundred times? In bracket, in tournament, we have over a hundred uh, sets against each other. Me and yeah. <laughs> uh, so speaking from very, very personal experience, uh, he is one of the smartest players that has ever touched this game. If you come out with some weird counterplay, he'll figure it out by the next game. Yes. He is absolutely insane. So you have to just be constantly mixing it up. And so that's what I really want to see from Torque. I really want to see uh, just don't let Chompers catch on to habits because they don't show in the first place, Yes. right? Like always be changing how you approach the neutral, especially recovery is going to be, I think, a very big deal because um, even though Raster has a fairly good recovery, um, some of these characters that depend on just jumping are going to have a bit of a hard time with icicles. Yes. Because they just, I mean, what are you going to do about them? They just come right down and you're kind of forced to either air dodge or get hit by them. And air dodge is a really valuable resource. You don't want to burn that every time icicles get thrown. No, out. especially not as raster. Yeah, exactly. I, I think that like you have you have four jumps in total, but burning that, especially against Edelus, is I would say any character burning air dodge against Edelus is just deadly. Yeah, flat out. Absolutely, especially because Chompers is very aggressive off stage. As soon yes. as he recognizes you've used it, he'll go for those up airs. He'll go for those up B spikes, which I think is something that Edelus uh, Edelus players don't go for often. He does. Yes. Like every time. All the time. Every time. Uh, he's he's absolutely terrifying. So I really, really want to see how Torque mixes up his game plan to to approach just a, a an adapt a, a adapting monster like this. Yes. The true biological weapon. <laughs> God I love Chompers. <laughs> God I love Torque. His tag is for sis. He's just such a nice guy. For his sister. I was uh, almost excited there because uh, all <laughs> one thing that Chompers likes to do is to put on a certain song, and because Edelus snaps with the pool party skin to bring more scoops of the ice cream onto the cone, he'll snap with the music yeah. that he plays. So I was hoping he was going to do that more, but he ended up not. That's how you know he's in serious mode. Yeah. He wants to win. <laughs> We're just doing a little bit of hand warmers, and we should get okay. into the set yeah, momentarily. It, it, it looked like it took Torque a minute to, to get set up. Yep. And they're having a good time on stage, they, so I, this should I be a fun it, set. Man. They're, just, they're just happy to play. They're just happy to be here. Ooh. I wonder what starting stage we're going to get. Yeah, pretty interesting. I know at least... Uh, What's going on? Oh, Torque just asking if we're ready to go. Oh, okay. I know historically he really likes Ethereal Gates, calls them Torqueal Gates. Yes. Uh, Chompers yes, also, at least in the past, really liked Ethereal Gates, so it, it very well could be the starter here. He certainly likes the stage a lot, and it is quite good for Edelus, but against Raster, I'm a little unsure on if he's going to spring for that. Yeah, see, oh, yeah. opting for the ban. And that, that's the thing, too, right? Is even though he has a lot of stages that wow. he likes and thinks are good for Edelus. He's always willing to adapt his game plan. Yes. Here we and go. The, the force floor pick, uh, I mean, it, it'll depend on how the set goes, of course, but Raster will die very early to the most common Edelus kill confirm yes. that we've seen. So if Torque is able to avoid that, not so much adapt, but avoid it, then I think this will be fine. So far doing a good reversal. Yeah, um, Chompers is kind of making a little bit of a mistake and uh, putting himself in a position where Torque could reverse him. Uh, he definitely could have just gone further on the stage, but kind of, he just didn't. He went back off stage. Oh, and he just lands. Oh, Ooh. great air dodge there. I think he's recognized that Torque has been going a lot for these uh, fair claps. Absolutely. Side. Oh, and actually burns oh, the wall no. jump to not make it back. That's really unfortunate, but... Uh, I, I really like the way that Torque was pressuring Chompers off stage, and so I think um, with the with the right intuition, finding that right kill confirm, definitely going to be able to bring it back. 
Uh, went for the uh, the down strong spike. Oh Ooh, my reads god! the air dodge in. <laughs> <laughs> what a read from Throne Orc. Oh, uh, he like like he opened the door so that Chompers could get in the taxi. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, that was the the call out of the sensory right there. Don't Great air dodge square. there. I, I like uh, the way that Tark kind of went up and to the right and just avoided any kind of threat from that entirely. So far, put him really good dies off the top. Wow, and Tork actually with a lead here. Uh oh. All right, dodges the Dacus, rolls to the right. Really good awareness, making sure he doesn't get caught by that. Yep, that's gonna do it. Always, uh, always gonna get the F smash on a parry read like that. Yeah, it's that's so hard to DI on a stage like this. Yeah, and not to mention also just it's a really strong knockback move. Um, it's Raster. Yep. I mean, Raster gets galaxy by that at like probably 80. I really like uh, Choppers is really good at these like dash attack, just follow and then little jab Whoa, combos. Oh, that call out. Yeah, there's <laughs> been a lot of call outs this set already, and. Well, it looked a little doomed for Chompers on that second stock. He's able to bring it back, take game one. I just love how calm Chompers always is. You know, we talk about this at locals and stuff, but like it, it's it's cool to be able to bring my insight to a, a player like him. Yeah, of course. He's, he's just never he never gets to come around. Um, it, he's just so calm and collected, no matter what happens to him. Like you could do the stupidest thing you could imagine to him, kill him at zero, and like the most you might get is like a heh. <laughs> yeah, like he just I, I mean off. that like to that point if I, I would love to see if Tork can can throw something crazy like that at him because you will know I don't have to go into specifics if he does something that that Chompers hasn't seen He will reel back his eyes will grow three sizes. Yeah. He will be beyond shocked However, at that crazy thing as a consequence you just upgraded the bio weapon exactly and He's never gonna get hit by it again. Yep. This is true <laughs> Actually leaves, actually leaves gates open, gives Torque his comfort pick. It's understandable. I feel like um, of the stages available, right? Like, um, the, the, this is probably the, just the least of all the evils, which is how it goes, right? Right. Um, I forgot what his four bands were already, but it, oh, there's, there's that the up special spike. spike. Yep. What a champion. And already, uh, th this is what I mean. Torque had a lead in the first game, and Chompers has already like researched his entire family tree and is now up and up a I full don't stock. like that. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean. It was funny, but still, like, <laughs> I mean, like you get what I mean. He's yes, just, of course. He's already figured out what to oh, do. He reads the roll in again, same as game one. Oh man! And had a really comfortable lead with all this ice, like. Yeah, he does have this ice. Uh, Torque manages to find a, a hit to pop him up, but it's just not going to go far enough. If he got that moonwalk down air into something, that would have been insane. Oh, goes for the up air. Doesn't quite find it. Going to be looking for a Dacus here, probably? Never mind. I'm a liar. I think if he... It could have been an up strong, but doesn't opt for it. I mean, if he gets a fair, the Raster is dead. Yeah, I mean, Raster at 152. Edelus is not wanting for kill moves. And also, he's up two stocks. He's, uh, it's going to be a monumental comeback if Torque manages this. He's, it almost looks like Jomper's is playing around a little bit. I feel like he had a few. I mean, he's being super safe and making sure he doesn't give anything up. But like, yep. oh, there no, it is. Oh, the drift Death out the on the Nair. It, that's what I was talking about. Yeah. Look at game one and instantly game 